Good evening, Ida. Laura, God bless you. Uh, I think we had to get this one out tonight, to be honest with you, because it is so important. And yes, it will. This is on Twitch. Twitch, by the way, let me get the Twitch up. This is on Twitch and it will be, it's live on Twitch, but it will be recorded on YouTube. Mary, Stephen, how you doing? I, get, I'm so, I don't know, it's, forget it. I'll get it right one day or another, but it is live on Twitch and it will be posted on YouTube. Okay, just letting everybody that sees us on YouTube wait for the chat. There won't be one on YouTube. Okay, so, and don't forget, thank you for everyone on the mailing list while it's up, the disciple contact at gmail.com. Thank you all for your news. It's, you know, I, I'm forgive me for not getting back to you. I am looking at all the emails, but I, I work through them on a daily basis. And I'm being short doing it today, but I'll get through it. But anyway, that's that. As the title says, Iran and China sign mind-numbing 25-year they wish. $400 billion partnership. Oh, we're going. Now, do hang on till we're finished because the team, I've, I've, <laughs> Laura's just told me what I needed to know, I think. Laura, if I ever get it wrong, you're to blame. Um, the ship that's in the Red Sea stuck, I'll tell you in a minute but you like what I'm going to say, I think. And correct me in the chat if I'm wrong. <laughs> I've rushed this today. But the first bit is is so important. But before we start these important parts, it is about the gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ and the advancement of the kingdom of Father God, whereby if you confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you are saved. There is no other way to God. There is no other way to God. For God so loved the world that he sent his only begotten Son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish but have eternal life. But when you ask the Lord into your life, when you confess that he is Lord and you start to believe, and I say start to believe, belief is the first step of an, an ever-increasing growing faith, or should be. But when you start on your journey, as I'm praying you do because it's getting close, as you start on your journey, then keep these things in your mind in 1 Corinthians 15, 1 to 4, it says, keep these things in your mind or heart, whichever version you're in. So keep close. I'm sorry, I, I don't want to raid the um, fellowship chat, by the way. Don't don't leave there. Stay there. I'll, I might get a chance to get over there afterwards when I've done all this stuff and caught up. But keep these things in your heart. I, you don't marry a wife and then put her on a shelf and you don't marry Jesus and put him up there and forget about him. You've got to keep in relationship. It's not about religion. There's no religion or religious building or statue or rosary beads or anything that can save you. Or oh, Mary, for that instance. Um, Mother Mary, as they call it. Only Jesus saves. Trust me. It's in your Bibles, if you're Catholic. It's in all the Bibles that are the Holy Bible. Because the Bible is Jesus for him, through him, and will be here as a testimony all the time, okay? But build a relationship. It is about a relationship. It's about you knowing him. You ask, he'll come in. He is standing at the door, knock, and it will be opened to you. And accept his free salvation. It's free to us, but it wasn't free to him. And it's not of works. Ephesians 2, 8 and 9. You cannot work, give, gift, or anything yourself to heaven it is in him alone in belief and in faith and it's getting desperately near it's getting desperately near to the lord's return why because we're going to show you some of the news i haven't got scripture points up tonight but everybody in this end is well adversed with scripture okay so first one is that oh just numbing, to be honest with you, as it says, is the only way I can describe it. Stay in the word, absolutely. But a revelation, isn't that an opening start? This is now the end begins. This came from, oh, uh, thank you, Brother Morley. Thank you, Brother Morley, for sending this. Revelation, Iran and China signed mine-numbing 25-year 400 
billion dollar comprehensive strategic partnership between the two world dictator nations. Oh my goodness, is this just not what we're looking for? Is this just, why am I laughing you might say? Because I'm about to go home. I want to go home. I really, really want to go home. <laughs> and home is where my heart is. The deal with China marked the first time Iran has signed, the first time Iran has signed such a lengthy agreement with a major world power. In, 20, in 2001, Iran and Russia signed a 10-year compra. What? Cooperation agreement? It's coming in. Ezekiel 38, 39. <laughs> Can't worry, it's an agreement. Mainly as a nuclear field. Boom. Check that one out with the earlier video on YouTube about the restrainer. Mm. That was lengthened to 20 years through two five-year extensions, the New York Times reported, that China will invest some $400 billion in Iran in exchange for oil as part of the deal. Wow. The two countries will also step up military cooperation with joint training, research and intelligence sharing. What? What? <laughs> what? Honestly? And they're saying the world is just going on. They'll be eating and drinking and marrying. And, and one will say, oh, you know how it goes. It's the last chance that's going to be happening, isn't it? For all those that are post-tribulationists. This will be the last chance that eating and drinking and marrying. And, and even that's cut short because of the virus, the plague. Have we ever been locked down before? If you knew, if you're on the Rewind or you're watching this from Twitch, have we ever been locked down before in a pandemic? Nope. Have we ever been forced to take that thing? No. Nope. But I can't go into that because I'm remembering that uh, this is going on YouTube because it needs to go out and it'll go on Rumble and on all the others and Instagram. But the, the ship stuck has been freed, by the way. But it just some mind-blowing information that came through last night in the admin room, and I've just confirmed some of it with Laura. Um, it's been freed, but let's have a look at it. The Suez Canal live updates forever given is free. Forever given. Interesting. Is free, clearing way for traffic to resume. Interesting point now they've just made them deals. Now, lo, lo and behold, anyone who tries to stop Iran exporting to China or Russia, lo and behold, it could be the trig point. But I just want to go into first, before I go into the rest of the article, what is absolutely mind-blowing. The ship at the Red Sea, where... Is it is at the point where Israel? Now get me get, correct me if I'm wrong, Laura. Left Egypt. <laughs> it's where Israel left Egypt, and it's now being freed. What? Silence. Pin drop. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. You know. Um, not so long ago, news wasn't coming out. Now, for some reason, it's coming out. And it's prophecy fulfilled that we will know more in these times. All the prophecies... I mean, is there any more prophecies to come? Yeah, 19, but they're all in tribulation. I can't find any more, although people post stuff. Um, Yale. Good evening. Good evening. I'm trying to read. I'll try and catch up. But it's so interesting. It's so amazing how it's coming together. And we can see it, can't we? But let's read this article um, anyway and just build up our knowledge. Aided by the moon and the tides. Interesting stuff. <laughs> interesting, isn't it? Aided by the moon and the tides. Look up. Look up. Hey, how many times does the Bible say that? The giant container ship was wrenched from the shore on Monday afternoon six, six days 
after blocking the vital route. Three times we've mentioned six in the last week's videos. Six days. Six days when Jesus came in. Six days, six days, six days. I'm going to have to do a video just on the six days, to be honest with you. That is interesting. <laughs> we pulled it off. Here's what we need to know. Okay, I, I haven't read this article. We pulled it off. After days of arduous labour, a ship is free and salvages are triumphant. Really? Aboard the tugboat part of the Armada that helped to free the stuck ship. I wonder how many tugs there were. Even just joking. Even when the ship the ship free, it will take time to clear the blockage of ships. The forces of nature mm, for the moon to wind to the wind played a key role in the crisis. Oil prices fall after giant container ship freed. That's another interesting one too. They fell. As crew worked to free the ship, the internet demanded that they put it back. That they put it back. Hmm. Delay threatens tens of thousands of animals aboard ships equated, queued at the canal. Is this the Ark as well thrown in here? I don't mean it's the Ark, but it's just like in the days of Noah. Sorry, my mind's going ape at the moment with all this stuff, to be honest with you. It's going absolutely bananas. It all seems to be coming in in the, say, in the right order of things to happen. But then God is a God of order. He's a God of forgiveness. You're saying, well, why did he bring all these things? He didn't. He's prevented the whole world wrap up back at Adam. He's given us time, 6,000 years, to get our act together. And we're not. We're getting worse. It's a shame. You know, if you want to blame God, you can't blame God for billions and billions and billions and billions and billions and billions being spent on killing each other instead of feeding the sick, developing cures. No, God is patient. And thank you and praise him that he is kind enough to let us be born in this time, the final days. I cannot see it as any other way, but the final time. The, 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 <laughs> the moon and the tides. What? Six days to free. What? Can you, could, you, could you write that stuff? <laughs> I'm sorry I'm laughing. I'm sorry I'm laughing, but I had to get this out. I really did. This is important with what we're doing, the restrainer being removed and so much more, all coming together at this time. We now discover when we read the article that Russia has got a 20-year deal with Iran and China have now got a 25-year deal with Iran, including weaponry. Um, US won't have a say anymore. They won't have a shout. They won't dare. And Iran will build itself like it's never built before so we're looking at the complete surrounding of israel which is more prophecy where it will be destroyed we're looking at the peace plan it's unfolded it's in it's um i'm not sure if it's the peace plan there could be another one but it doesn't really matter it's here in my opinion i'm not a date setter you know that it's just a psst, what do you think what do you think Oh, I can't wait to see. I can't get comments on here, only in the live chat. But I can't wait to see the comments to add to this, not distract from this, in the YouTube broadcast, which I'll download after this and get it over, maybe get it out tonight. But brothers and sisters, thank you all for coming on from Twitch and a great God bless to all that work in the Discord server. Wow, nearly forgot that. I'm so excited. Where's the Discord server? Come on, guys. Say hello. <laughs> we have a Discord. You on Twitch know it. Discord pretty well know what... Uh, YouTube pretty well know what Discord's all about. Um, it's a server. We've used it as a church, okay? They can use it as what they want, but we use it as a church. And we've built it up to one... Uh, 3,000, oh gosh. 
Man, it's growing every day. It is growing every day with 3,841 now and coming in on a daily basis for fellowship and getting together. There are 10 ministries in there. I'll run through them quickly. Baptism, divine healing. Yes, <laughs> let me show that while I read these. Here we go. <laughs> I love this part. I really do. Yes. <laughs> this is the family. Baptism, uh, Victoria, Grace Girl Victoria, Divine Healing, Cal M, Healing Through Deliverance, Mary, Laura, Christine, Ida, Jess, me, and Cal M, Bible Studies, Mary, Jess, and yes, Tornell, you're still employed. The wages are absolutely rubbish. Brother Molly, <laughs> Server Watcher, Help Scripture, and the bringer of this news tonight. Ida, Free Bible. You need a Bible, guys. You need a Bible. Look at this. Um, and there's a Berean room, Ida's Berean room, or Ida Berean room, uh, where we post entire everything we're finding. I never thought of checking in there, to be honest. What a fool! I could have got a better report on the a more comprehensive report on what I've just done. Brother Frank, holistic medicine room. Brother will help you away from um, big pharma if you've got problems. Author Michael Middleton's is book where his proceeds go to. YWAM, so it's a charity. And the communion, of course, are Jess, and I'm not sure if anyone else is doing it. I need to have a, I need to know more, to be honest with you. <laughs> but here it is. Here it is. Just join the, the, the link in the description. And it says there's a little Discord URL alongside it, the disciple server with a Discord URL. Can't change that. It's the program that I think Jeff Bates, Bates, Microsoft, Bill Gates, <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking Bezos, Bill Gates, Microsoft, I think are going to purchase the whole thing out, <clears throat> which is irrelevant to us. I don't think we're going to be around that long enough, but it is, it's a fellowship with all ministries in, come in humbly, give everybody a fair chance and just be with the Lord. If you don't know the Lord, come there too, if you want to know him. I, I, I stress that, if you want to know him, that is the place that you will find good fellowship because not all churches are good fellowship not all churches are good fellowship I can assure you you need to be with godly people you need to know what Jesus has set before you and be encouraged brothers and sisters <laughs> on Twitch I just say and on YouTube because this will be on YouTube I will just leave you with as usual may God bless you keep you make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you this day and always till we get home under that great big picnic basket. I don't know whether we'll get one, but it's a desire of my heart. I'll just say good night and God bless. 